Ron here. I'm going to use this automotive relay and uh, show the back EMF, that is the electromagnetic flyback, from this tiny coil. You're used to seeing uh, me play with this gigantic coil. And here's the big coil compared to the coil I'm using today. This little guy can put out a uh, good amount of energy as well. Do, 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 do. The circuit we're using is the uh, Imhotep relay charger circuit. See if I got that all in there. And basically, it's a uh, uses an automotive relay as an electromagnet. And let me reach around the camera here. The electromagnet is connected to the charge battery through this contact. There's the source battery, the run battery here. So when the electricity flies around the orange path here, energizes this coil, as soon as it's energized, it pulls the contact, the flapper spring, away. So the battery is disconnected. So the flapper spring flies back and forth very quickly uh, just to produce electromagnetic flyback and electromagnetic flyback only. So I'm going to use doo -doo 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 -doo. this battery pack, AA batteries, comes in at 10.6 volts. I'm not going to bother to bore you with details. And basically, I'm going to hook the circuit up. Hope you can see all that. I'm going to connect it up here and uh, light the light bulb with an automotive relay and some DC batteries. Let me take this off the tripod here. So, batteries are hooked up. This little guy is running, this little flapper is moving. You can hear it buzzing if I put it against the wood. And it's enough energy to light a 2 watt light bulb. It's not all the way brightness, but it just goes to show that there is some uh, good energy uh, just in the flyback. Uh, so we're getting some peaks up near 100 volts, and we're getting enough amperage to start this circuit up which requires 45 milliamps so this light bulb thinks it's getting 120 volts like it's plugged in to the uh, wall socket from a tiny 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 coil with the connection just being made and broke that's it that's all this is let me uh, put the camera back up here again just want to show one more one more little detail that uh, if you connect a battery pack straight up to the light bulb of course nothing happens it's just 12 well actually 10.6 volts DC and that is not enough to start anything going but if you just put that energy into a coil and suddenly stop the coil 2,000 times a second You get some pretty good energy. Pretty nifty, eh? You can tell that's lit, right? Just demonstrating electromagnetic flyback. This is Ron. See you.